Do you have a favorite book that you would like me to read? In the comments below, leave a little note and tell me what story you think would be a good one to read. And I will take it into consideration and see if I can find it. Let's get reading. Today's story is Chester's Back. Welcome back to Storytime. As you can see, Mr. Relic has joined me again for some pets. Hey, Relic. <laughs> he loves story time as well. Today we are going to read Chester's Back. Let me tell you a little bit about this story. Chester's Back. As you can see from his star sheriff badge on his fur, he thinks he's in charge. So what happens when Chester wants to write his own story and not what the author wishes to write for him? Follow along and we are going to find out. Let's start reading. A long time ago in a faraway land lived a cat named Chester. I said, a long time ago in a faraway land lived a cat named Chester. Not ready yet. A long time ago, Chester, not that long ago, boring cave cat takeover, ooga chaga, ooga chaga. A long, 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 long time ago, in a faraway cave lived Chester. He was famous. He invented the wheel. Little did the cave cat know that soon he would become extinct. Now, Chester, let's try this again. A long time ago, in a faraway land lived a... Stinky dinosaur in need of a major breath mint. Chester, get out from behind there. Nope, this side works way better. Chester, cut it out. If you say so, ladies and gentlemen, I, the great Chester Dini, will now attempt to saw this boring drawing in half. Chester, don't do it. Kaboom! Meet Melody the Bearded lady. That's it, Chester. No more clowning around. It's time for your disappearing act. Open editions on the next page. Melanie Watt seeks replacement to play the role of Chester. Number one, please step into the story. Poof. Bunch of copycats. A long time ago, in a faraway land, lived a cat named Chester. Wait a minute. Chester, step away from the new Chester. This page ain't big enough for the both of us. I'm out of here. Chester, I give up. What do you want? Glad you asked. I want a story that takes place in a long limousine. I want giant billboards with my face on them all over the city. And since I'm very famous, I demand jelly beans, but only the red ones. And oh yes, my name written in light. And when I arrive on the red carpet, I want everyone to see I'm a big star. Is that it? Mm, and a bell so that I can ring for mouse anytime I need something. Fine, Chester. Hmm, make that Sir Chester. Okay, sir, you asked for it. Not long ago, in a big city somewhere, a very famous cat named Sir Chester arrived in a long, long, long limousine filled with red jelly beans. Everyone was excited to see. The Big Star. That's not what I had in mind. The end.